Hello and welcome to another episode of Philomena.com. I'm back and today I'm taking you to a very, very special place here in Monrovia. We are in Mama Point across from the old U.S. Embassy. And if you've been here, you know there is a little village of arts and crafts owners. I've been here many times. You probably have seen this place before in a previous episode with Adventures with Zuleika. She loves this place as well, but it's very special and near and dear to my heart because when I came back to Liberia for the first time after the war in 2001, my father who passed away five years ago, this was the first place he brought me. So today I'm gonna to be taken around by my good friend Helen. She is a matriarch here in the community. She's gonna show us all the different artists here, what they feature, and I hope some of you will be coming to visit soon and buy these goods up. Helen, say hello to the uh, Philomena.com followers. Hello, Philomena.com followers. <laughs> when I travel uh, 2006 to Mali, when I when I saw the ladies doing their tie dye, their prints, I fell in love with them and started learning from them in Mali. When I came back, I really got interested in in business. At the time when I got back, so I started something small. And that was just the beginning of my yeah. career. Yeah. And, and now it's, it's now my career. Right. So talk to us about the Union of Liberian Artists. This is the sign uh, up yes, here. Yes, this is the uh, Union of Liberian Artists. And you are, what, what is your position? I'm the treasurer. She's the treasurer yeah. of the Union of Liberian Art Artists. And now we have almost like a thousand five members. Oh, wow. Yeah, it's, it's a big union. Wow, wow. We have weavers, tie-dye, uh, quilters. Yeah, our union is big covered. So when, so when you're in Morovia and you yeah. see all these street vendors all around, these are probably members of the Liberian. Members of the union, yes, yes. And how do you all uh, work together uh, to make sure your what your common goal is? Or what, let, let's say, what is your common goal as the Liberian, uh, the union of Liberian artists? My goal is to see all artists, all creative artists doing something growing up, building their own businesses, like I did from the beginning. Right. I came from scratch. To where I am, and I still want to forge forward. So we're here. We're in Helen's art shop, mm -hmm. and we're gonna see all the different art pieces that you have. But I want to talk about your specialty. Okay. What do you consider to be your specialty in in the Liberian arts and crafts arena? Okay. But my specialty is I do jewelry. Jewelry. I love my jewelry. Ooh. Okay. Let's yeah. take a look. Let's take a look. So we have. So do yeah. you hand make all these? Yeah. Wow. Mm -hmm. Wow. So these and are like, bracelets. Yeah, these are bracelets. Uh -huh. Like I'm doing African art. So what I do, I travel Africa. Mm -hmm. I just coming from Togo two days ago. My ghost is not here yet. Okay. Yeah, I travel Africa. I buy my art. I mix my art. I have like different art, and I have arts from all over Africa. Okay. And these ones are made by me from here. Here, like here. Yeah. So these it's are like here. Yes. Yes. Okay. And this one is is Mali. Okay. I got a piece from Mali. Beautiful. Mm hmm. Very this beautiful. is ebony. You only find ebony in Mali. Wow. Yeah. But this is my handmade. Handmade my by little bees. Yeah. <laughs> These are beautiful. Yeah. Okay. Looks like I'm not being some shopping trouble here today because <laughs> I'm already picking out what I want to buy in here. Okay. The African that time we don't have no bank. We can all the uh, small small people then they can in the village village then one put the money together and then here you put the money here they have the bank there to keep it. A chair. This chair. Uh huh. You sit down. Okay. Cheap chair. Cheap. It's a cheap chair. Okay. Okay. I don't know. This doesn't look so comfortable. Thank you, woman. You can see on the chair. <laughs> oh, Lord, open it. You can sit on the chair. Oh. Thank you. Will you lay back? Yeah, lay back. Relax. Yes. All right. Relax. I like it. I like it. I feel Labor the breeze. The thing will be coming now. Thank I you. can for the country. Yes. <laughs> Don't start that conversation. <laughs> okay, so this is a very popular instrument yes. in Liberia. Mm -hmm. You carve these. Yes. And they're called the salsa. The salsa. 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 This is the sound that they make, right? Yeah. So Helen, tell us the, the, the background behind the salsa. Salsa is our traditional instrument where we use in our 
Mostly using our traditional dances, like the Sunny Bush when our girls are coming out of the Sunny Society, mm -hmm. it's used there. Uh, we use it for the culture, like the culture center, and is is a is a it's like a messenger. The salsa also is like when the it, it's a sign of sometimes when the salsa sound is sound of our culture dance. Maybe yeah. our culture dancers are on their way coming. All ah, right. Yeah. So it's a very powerful instrument. I've been using like Bima here for many years. Yeah. Okay, so since you have a lot of experience, start the beat. We will join you. Okay. Then maybe okay. Just go like this. You go like this. They're like no spinning. They're like this. Mm -hmm. All right. Go down the hall. Go down the hall. Sing louder now so they can hear you. Sing. Sing one here. Sing the song. Go down my head. 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 <laughs> so I went to the Liberian Museum of History last year and I saw this behind glass. But this is the way that Liberians used to buy things. This was our currency back in the day. So can I get some history? Let's explain this. This was, uh, before here we used to do battle system. Yeah. Battle system is I have a little bit of cassava. You got a piece of leaf fish. Okay. Yes. You give me a piece of your leaf fish right. you do, and I give you a little bit of cassava. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> then after that, you know our people sat down and they created yeah. this money. Okay. Okay. They said we had a battle system so that it wasn't working in all the places. So we started using this money. This like your original money. Okay. If you want to direct a woman now in Lofa County, mm -hmm. and if you don't have this money, my I'm not gonna get mad. No way. What <laughs> Still till today. Up to now. 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 Up to So all you lo-fi girls, you know, yes. when you're ready to get married, you better tell your guy, if so you're from Morovia, you, you better come. Yeah, you better come, yeah, you come to him, man. And carry the one to impress your father-in-law. <laughs> or you will not get the woman. <laughs> So we are here with Mr. Mohamed Conte. He is one of a kind here in Liberia, right? The only one who can do his craft in Liberia is this man here. So let's talk about it. What is it that you do? I do ethnic crafts. Okay. Bone jewelry carving. Bone jewelry carving, okay. So when you say bone, what type of bones do you Cow bone. Cow bones. Cow bone. So you take the the scraps of the uh, cow after people have eaten, yeah. and you take that bone and you bone. make it into jewelry, sculptures, everything. So after y'all strip the meat, everybody for it, eating all their sweet sweet pepper soup. This is what we get, and you turn those this bone into art. Wow, and the color starts to come out. See? Yeah. And you know what I like about this is it resembles um, ivory, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It, re it resembles ivory, but it doesn't. It doesn't. Not ivory. It's not ivory. It's a single which, bone. Exactly. From cow. Exactly. And I think it's an ethical alternative than killing off the wildlife, which is something that. Uh, Africa as a whole, the continent is suffering from culture. Okay, so you've given me all these options. Look at all this beautiful jewelry. The white, the brown, the small, the large. Okay, okay, I have a lot of thinking to do. All right, I'm gonna take these two. Okay. And how much do I owe you, sir? Ten dollars. Ten dollars. Okay, so twenty for these. Wow. Here you go. Okay. You Look at much. these guys. Beautiful earring, bone, just for ten dollars a ten dollars a piece. Kind. 